In the Tuscaloosa County Jail, there have been various reports of COVID-19 cases among inmates and correctional officers inside the jail, and several members in the community are finding ways to help stop the spread. WVUA 23's Sydney Spencer has more on this story. Back in December, members of one local church in Tuscaloosa gathered outside the Tuscaloosa County Courthouse to protest the lack of protective gear in COVID-19 cases among inmates in the county jail. Since the protests, members of Grace Presbyterian Church have now taken matters into their own hands by hosting a mass drive for inmates. We thought, well, we should, if, maybe if we give them masks, they'll be able to get everybody a mask every day. Coordinator of the drive and member of Grace Presbyterian Church, Mike Altman, says their goal is to donate as many masks as they can so that every inmate will receive a new one throughout their stay. Everyone should have a new mask every day. I mean, this is a jail setting where you got a lot of turnover. People are crowded together real close. They're sharing cells, much less common spaces. Since launching the mask drive, Altman says they have received an estimate of 15 to 20,000 masks. A total he feels the jail is more than capable of providing inmates themselves. But that jail generates about around $60,000 a month just off commissary and phone calls from the people that are in there. So I think some of that could go towards testing and mass. As of Wednesday, the state of Alabama Department of Corrections has reported 1,255 total COVID-19 cases among the inmate population throughout the state. Out of those reported, the total number of cases within the Tuscaloosa County Jail has not been put out to the public. Altman says he wants people in the community to realize that this issue isn't only affecting those within the jail. I don't think people realize that the COVID in the jail doesn't stay in the jail. I talked to somebody who was in there for just over a week, didn't have COVID when they came in, came out a couple days later, tested positive, and their uh, two family members that they were staying with when they came out tested positive too. So it's spreading out from the jail into the community. For those interested in donating, search on Facebook, Tuscaloosa Jail Mask Drive. The church is asking for disposable surgical masks to be dropped off at the church during their office hours Monday 9 a.m. to noon and Tuesday through Friday from 9 a.m. to 4.30 p.m. They will be dropping off the first batch of masks to the jail on Monday. Sydney Spencer, WVUA 23 News.